What's up, Blazerman? Welcome back to the bullshit today. I'm going to be showing you guys, this is going to be part, or episode 2 of Command Block Tutorials. I'm going to show you guys how you guys can do the tell raw command. Uh, we're going to get right into it. I'm not going to yap for as long as I did today. Or for as long as I did yesterday, my bad. Uh, command block, you want to use, you just want to use simple slash give command block. I showed that in the last video. Uh, last video was uh, slash title raw, if you didn't uh, know. So I would do that. Uh, but this one is going to be slash tell raw. Um, hang on, I forgot to open my notes. I am a bit excited. I'm on I'm on the YouTube grind this month. I I don't know. This month just seems kind of different. So I'm gonna be I'm gonna be grinding YouTube out like a like an actual champion. So okay. So if you guys would like to know how you guys can do your uh, make a custom chat message, which is what Tell Raw pretty much is. Is Tell Raw is fancy. Uh, message you can do sudo you can make people say stuff and this can be running the console or this can be running command block so it's like a, a on chat message so for starters always put your command you want to put your command block to repeat or uh and always active and if you want to make a set ticks delay sort of like a server message you could be like you know 500 or like 5000 for x amount of minutes or you could do 24 for every uh or 20 for every second it, it'll say it in the chat for mine, I'll make it say, uh, I'm not going to do this, but I would recommend this for like section servers if you're doing adverts in the chat and all that, so that's that's simple stuff. But for this, I'm going to do a simple button that you would press. So once you've gotten all that done, and you can now open the command block and you want to type in tell raw at A or at the player, like you could do at like tag equals XYZ or uh, e M equals for mode, you know. So it only goes for specific people or like specific tags, IDs, that kind of thing. But for this, it's going to be keep it simple. Uh, tell, we'll do tell raw. Comment down below if you have something to do in an in depth thing on the execute command. Um, I can do that too. Um, but we'll do tell raw run. Uh, no, no, we don't do that. I'm looking at a different note. My bad. Uh, we'll do the squiggly bracket, raw text, uh, and bracket, uh, sad face, and then squiggly bracket like this. We'll do text, and then, er, no. Wow, I'm way off. The, no, I, I was right. I was right. No, no, no. Text, and then we'll do this. And here is kind of where you can do really whatever. It, uh, whatever you really want here. Um, um, Hello from a command block. And then we will do this. And pretty much that is it for this exactly. So now, if you say it's console, hello from the command block. Now, you might be wondering, well, I could just do the slash say command in a command block. Yes, you could. You could do slash say hello. Uh, and then do console but if you notice it's always you're always forced to have some repeating repeater so if you don't have a repeater it'll do a little divot here or, or it'll say console right whereas with this you don't you can literally just have it say uh, you could literally just have to say hello from a command block uh, and all that so that's that's good for like NPCs talking and stuff because if you look uh, p players have the little brackets or arrows and it's actually pretty good so I think that's pretty much it for this tutorial really short tutorial it's not that crazy complex of a command um, if you actually wait I should show you guys how you can get your name to be displayed here um, too because you know we gotta go we gotta be in-depth you know these are in-depth guides so you wanna do the little brackets you know same thing selector uh, at A or at S for myself and that should be it there we go oh wait what hmm? Hmm? huh wait No, I did it right. What what's going on here? S 
selector at S. Okay, well, so let's do selector at A. There we go. Okay, so let's selector at A. I was, I guess I was wrong. Okay. So it'll, that'll now say your name. You can also get it to display scores and objectives and stuff. You can get, you can really get it to do basically what this does. So it's pretty much a title raw, but instead of it being a on-screen scoreboard, it is a text scoreboard. So you can actually have player scores listed in the chat, uh, which is pretty cool. Um, you could pretty much do like a leaderboard system if you wanted to. That's kind of cool. But uh, if you guys enjoyed the tutorial, you know, let me know. Drop a like. And uh, yeah, that's about it I have for today. See ya.